Hello, this is Crazy Old Man. Uh, I was watching a YouTube tutorial the other day where the instructor was going to show us how to create a 1957 Ford Thunderbird in Blender. And what he did was he cropped out each of these four images and saved them to separate files in GIMP. Uh, I don't know or use GIMP, but I do use Paint.net so I can show you how to do it if you know, know how to use paint.net. Use your selection tool. Draw a box around the area that you want to copy to the clipboard. You may have to restart a couple times to get exactly the selection you want. And this touches the roof, the bumpers, and the bottoms of the tires. So that's perfect. Once you've made the selection, do an edit, then do copy. You've got it copied to the clipboard. You create a new file in paint.net, file, new, and it remembers the dimensions of this area you just selected. So you can do an edit paste and it pastes as, as a new image. Now this is larger than what you would think uh, but it is a very large image we were working from and the instructor in the video uh, regarding the Thunderbird will show you how to uh, reduce the size once it's imported into Blender. Now we do a file save and I've already saved this, but just to show you how I'd resave it. And you can repeat the same for the rest of the uh, image. You can do the front, the rear, and the top separately. And then you'll have all the images you need for the tutorial. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.